my channel it's your girl Nisha back with another video and if you're new here welcome welcome and I only want to talk about things that I do that makes me you know feel better like practices that I do I would say they're I don't know mindful positive just positive things that I do that makes me feel positive you know I just want to tell y'all some of those and tell y'all how it make me feel so yeah let's get into the video i won't make y'all wait no the first thing i would say i do that like i have to do it like it's mandatory it's no if and but about it i have to do it cleansing i cleanse my room smoke cleanse you can cleanse it's many ways to cleanse but i smoke cleanse that is my favorite way to cleanse smoke cleanse i use your basanta sage I make these instant combs from scratch, right? And they smell really good. So I use my instant combs. And also, I went to Five Below the other day. And I got these Dragon Blood uh, incense. These smell so good. They smell so freaking good. Like, these are the best incense I have ever smelled in my life. In my life. Besides these. But, <laughs> like, store incense, like, the best. I promise you, the best. But basically... Yerba Santa, incense, incense cones, they all make me feel so good when I cleanse because I'm empath, right? And a lot of times, like, I don't have the most healthiest household. And I know people that I can't just stay away from them because, like, they're here. I can try, but they're here. Um, they're very negative. Like negative and i be needing this cleanse my room day and night with this cleanse myself with it and yeah that's basically what i do that helps me stay good i gotta cleanse and they all make me feel good and some things that i say when i'm cleansing is like i'll say thanks and then i'll do like i am it's like thank you for cleanse energy thank you for purified energy thank you for peace uh thank you for moving negative energy and then i'll be like um i am cleansed i am purified uh i am love i am like you know stuff like that like i would say i am and then i would you know say what i'm thankful for and stuff like that that's basically how i cleanse and with these i don't i don't really do that sometimes i do but sometimes i just like light it set my attention and sit it down and let it do its thing and it's the same thing with this but when it comes to sage i really do my i am's and i do my thank yous the whole look uh, you know, I do all of that. So, yeah, next thing that makes me feel good that I love doing, I really enjoy it, journaling. Like, I'm going to tell you, I'm going to tell you about it, and I'm going to show you all my journals. Another thing that helps me stay positive and helps me feel good, journaling. I'm telling you, I have maybe one, two, three, three journals that I have finished already, and I love them. I go back and read it sometimes. It's funny. <laughs> the stuff that I put myself through and the growth from then to now it makes me laugh because i'll be like wow i was really like that growth i really thought that way growth what was wrong with me why would i even let someone you know walk over me like that growth when you realize like i i have such a big heart and when i'm reading that i see how big my heart is growth but yeah i got these journals from walgreens they were like ten dollars it's okay though because they were worth it like they are really like thick and they're like really good journals like really good journals who have made these snap I promise you i really enjoy these journals and i love journaling like at the end of the day i would journal about my day uh if something irritated me i pull out my journal write about it I like to release everything at the end of the day. Talk about everything that I went through. What made me happy? What made me sad? What made me mad? Um, you know, what made me excited? What did I do today? I like to do all of that because I like to release everything. I don't like to hold on to anything at the end of the day. I don't want to go to sleep with anything on my mind. I don't want to go to sleep mad, you know? Some people ain't gonna care about making you mad and making your day bad, but guess what? I'm not gonna let I'm not gonna let myself go to sleep mad. So I write about it and I release everything from today into the journal. And I release it and I move on and I go on with my life. And that's another thing that I do that makes me feel good is journaling. Because journaling is it's a really good one. It really is. But yeah, that's another thing. The next thing I would say I do that makes me feel good. Reading. Oh my god. 
I'm finna show y'all my book collection. Y'all gonna be like, okay, okay, I'm finna show y'all. Okay, so before I go into books, I do want to talk about one more thing. It's called Today I Affirm, and it's full of journal prompts and so much stuff, you know. And it's really nice. I enjoyed it, and I got it from Five Below. And I got this one from Amazon. I like journaling, but I also like these because it's prompts in here for me to, like, just go in and do, you know. I really like it. It's, it's cool. But anyway, so we got Everyday Magic. That's just, like, a simple little book full of rituals spells and potions to live your best life i haven't really did anything in this book but i was just looking at it you know i was interested and then we have moon magic it teaches you it teaches you all about the moon all about it it's really nice and it was only five dollars i got that one from five below and i got the everyday magic from earthbound this book was my first book i think i bought mm -hmm. and i got it from amazon and it's by a black author about a book about black people <laughs> and it's really nice and when I tell you you're gonna be shocked once you finish it you're gonna be like what like you wouldn't even expect it, it's just very much shocking um the next book the subtle art of not giving a f because why give a f and I got this but this came with some other stuff it's the five below it's called the power of chakras um yeah let me move on let me move this and then i got this one you are a bad a like when i tell you when i found out that i like books for real for real that was the first book i bought and then after that i started spamming spamming books on amazon and all of these books is new except for black water tales the secret keepers which i just showed y'all that one that one isn't new i love it though so I, after i found out i like books i started spamming books Spamming. I mean, I bought so many. Um, but anyways, you are a bad A. The Four Agreements. Black Water Tales. This is the new one. This is the second one I just bought because, oh my God. When I tell you, I enjoy Secret Keepers so much that I had to buy another one. Next one is the Melanin Empath. And then the next one is the Sacred Woman. A Guide to Healing the Feminine Body, Mind, and Spirit. And I can't wait to, <laughs> this book is thick though. I can't wait to read all of these books. So yeah, we got The Sacred Woman, Melanin Empath, Black Water Tales, The Unwanted, The Four Agreements, You Are a Bad A, period. Um, the Subtle Art of Not Giving a F, Black Water Tales, The Secret Keeper, Moon Magic from Five Below, and Everyday Magic from um, Earthbound. And this is my book collection. And I also got a cookbook, but... That's not really that important. But it is a vegan cookbook made by a black woman. It's called Sweet Potato Soul. 100 Easy Vegan Recipes. I recommend. I recommend. But yeah, so far we got cleansing. We got journaling. And we got reading books. Those are all things that keep me feeling good. Because a lot of times I don't like to be on my phone all day. And I had a habit of doing that that I'm trying to break. So I do these things when I have nothing else to do because they make me feel good and it keeps me off of my phone all day, you know, especially reading. I can read all day. I promise you. Um, Next thing I do that makes me feel good is yoga. And I'm, I'm going to show you all my yoga book. This yoga book is so nice. It's called Speedy Yoga, 50 Peaceful Poses to Balance um, Your Busy Life. I recommend it was at five below for five dollars and also if you're a beginner what I do is I look up yoga videos like beginner yoga videos nighttime and morning time to do you know to start off but I also like doing some of these sometimes but most of the times like morning and night I try to just like look up yoga videos instead of trying to do this because it's, it's kind of complicated when you're first starting but yeah like I'm I really enjoy yoga, but I'm not that flexible, <laughs> so it's hard sometimes, especially with some of these poses, like, ain't no way you expect me to do that. Uh-uh. I can barely do a lunge. You expect me to do that? I, I cannot do a lunge. Like, I can't do lunges. And you expect me to do that? Mm -mm. This one, I like these. They're cool. And then certain stuff. 
for me. I just can't do certain stuff because my boobs will not let me bend down like that. Like, I can't. Like this one. No, I, I can't. And I'm not flexible. But other than that, these, it's, it's a really good book. Other than that. Oh, this one. This one is a funny one, but it's actually peaceful. I, I, I have a, a yoga video that I'll be doing, and she'll be having us doing that. But yeah, basically, yoga, cleansing, journaling, and reading are things that I do that makes me feel good. Another thing that I do that makes me feel good is breath work. I love breath work. Like, that's what I do in the morning time when I get up. And I have an app, and I'm going to show you guys my app. I don't know the name right now, but I'm going to put it on the screen. And it's really good. And they have simple breath work videos that I really enjoy, that I really enjoy doing. Especially, like, some stuff is to get you energized. And some stuff is to calm your mood. And some stuff is to awake you. So, it's like, that app got some good stuff. Like, good stuff. That app is really good, and I enjoy it myself. And yeah, breath work is what I do because, you know, like I be having panic attacks and anxiety sometimes. So it helps me calm down and I can get stressed out um, easily and get irritated easily, especially as an empath. And sometimes I don't even like it don't even be me that's irritated. It's somebody else. And it came on to me. So it's like the breath work is another thing that I do that makes me feel good, that calm me down, that keeps me positive. Breath work. It's amazing. Another thing that I do that keeps me positive and keeps me feeling good, my sound bow. I got this sound bow from, I think, Amazon? I think so, yeah. And it wasn't that much. It was like maybe around like close to 30. I'm not sure. I don't remember. I don't even think I bought it. Somebody else bought it for me. <laughs> and I really liked it. I really enjoy using this sound bowl. It makes me feel good. I like to use it in the morning time, in the night time. Whenever I feel like I need it, I use it. But I try to use it consistently. Sometimes I don't. But I use it when I know I need it. Like, I need it for real. And last, last thing. I believe it's the last thing. Yeah. Meditation. That's another thing I do. I meditate like I don't overdo it I do like something simple like 10 minute meditations I really enjoy them 10 minute, 10 minute meditations and it makes me feel good like it clears my mind it calms me and I do different meditation for different things okay so a train just went past so I'm gonna continue what I'm saying yeah meditation and I follow this YouTube channel for meditations I forgot what it's called but when I figure it out I'm gonna put it on the screen so yeah, those are some things that I do that make me feel good. I cleanse, um, I journal, I read, uh, what else do I do? I do breath work and I meditate. I think I got everything, yeah. Cleansing, journaling, reading, breath work, uh, using my sound bowl and meditating. Those are all the things that I do that makes me feel good that put me in a good mood and that keeps me positive especially as an empath i'll be needing these things and they 100 percent work and it's like building a routine routine like doing this routine really helps me stay positive and stay feeling good and i like this routine i like it a lot but yeah that's basically it for my youtube video and if these you know tips help you and these you know mindful i guess mindful practices help you let me know let me know if you already been doing it let me know if you finna start let me know what you think of my video and uh, yeah and i'll be back for another one my next video probably gonna be a tarot video so yeah thank you for watching and if it's your first time watching make sure you hit that subscribe button because i know i know you enjoyed this video mm -hmm.
Mm-hmm. I need it. Mm -hmm. But yeah, that's it. See y'all next time. Oh, man, I